this is supreme intelligence this is a new video and this one is gonna be about just take control of yourself what i mean when you take control of yourself is like it could be a spouse your parents or people around you sometimes people around you want to take control of your life and then yourself sometimes you don't even realize they taking control of you excuse me like my mom you know what i'm saying at one point she wanted to control everything that i do she wasn't ha excuse me she wasn't happy with anything she wasn't happy like who i dated who like my job anything she like when you got somebody like that, you know what I'm saying, when you get to a certain age, you got to let go. Like, look, I'm doing this. I'm going to do this. You know what I'm saying? This is how it's going to be. I'm, it's good that you gave me advice or whatever. But these, it's like what I'm trying to say, when people got mind control over you and some people don't realize it, it's very difficult and very hard for them to understand like what you're trying to do or, or say is like they just trying to bully you into being a certain way that they want especially with, with especially with parents like they got they never can accept that that child is grown up they always see their child as being the little child that they would carry around change diapers and feeding bottles or breasts or whatever you know what I'm saying is like parents gotta learn to let go of of that and not just parents it's like like with me when I can say the problem that I have you know what I'm saying I'm quiet so I don't like to argue because I don't like to say I don't like to say things at times that was going that's gonna hurt somebody's feelings or whatever so sometimes some people will want me to be a certain way and that's not in my character like i'm outgoing and stuff um i love i love people and i love to see my people grow and shine but at the same time i've seen situations where the woman in the relationship but like bully the, the man in a certain way, if that makes any sense. It's not bullying. It's like, you're supposed to do things this way. This is how you're supposed to do it. And I've seen one situation where a girl's like, well, well, if you would um, um do as I say, you know what I'm saying? We wouldn't have these problems or whatever. We wouldn't have these issues or whatever. No, no, no. That's not how you talk to somebody that you're with or you love or you see your future with. You know what I'm saying? What I say, the best thing that you can do is just calm down, relax, and say, talk. It's like when someone talks to you like mad and angry and stuff, that is it's sort of a bad, bad idea because when someone's angry, no one's gonna listen to you if you're you're angry and stuff. You know what I mean? So always take control. So always have self control and always take control of your life. Cause when you don't take control of your life, and it's when you don't take control of your life. You know what I'm saying? Or things that's in your life that. We all have control over everything in our life. You know, it's just sometimes we allow people to take control of certain things. Like, it's just one thing I learned about people, once they know that they can get inside your brain and they got control of your brain, sometimes it's a wrap. Because once they got control of, of your mental state, everything else would would come you ever heard that that saying like the best way to a woman or best way to a man is 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 through they bring like me i'm a i'm a thinker so the best way to get to me besides food is you know is my brain like when i first meet a woman i'll see how she is 
how to see how she walks and talks and once I see like how she is, you know what I'm saying? The feelings will come. You know, everything else will come. Like I'm a thinker. I like to to think. I, sometimes my conversations be a little off or whatever. Cause a lot of times, like lately, people have been saying, Well, what the fuck are you talking about? So, like I said, take control of your life. Don't have no one don't have no one tell you that you know what I'm saying that what they say is right all the time. Like my dad always told me this, if you meet somebody and they say that they're right all the time, that's a problem. That means that if if they do something wrong, they will never apologize to you. And like my dad told me before at one point, he was like, if you meet a woman and she's willing to, and she's willing to admit her wrong, you're lucky. Because a female would never tell you that she's wrong. Most women would like drag whatever they did in, into the ground before they even say sorry or anything. To the ladies out there, all it takes is just a sorry. Like, yeah, I fucked up. That's it. After you say that, your dude or whatever would probably do jumping jacks. Say, damn, she apologized. You know, the most thing, like I say, is um, I'm all about people being happy and in love. Like, when you love somebody, you're going to admit your wrongs, your faults, and everything. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes the person doesn't see, see it see things the way you see things it doesn't mean that you're right or that person's wrong for feeling that way it, it's not you know this, we all think different like I'm a really deep thinker you know what I'm saying like I told you in a, video, a past video that I have visions and like I said in one of the last videos like because you have visions doesn't mean that the person doesn't trust you or any type of way doesn't love you or nothing. There's just thoughts. It doesn't mean that that's what the person thinks you're going to do or going to do or whatever. Yeah, just take control of your life. Don't let people tell you what to do and stuff. If it's something good, yeah, but something bad or something like I said before with parents they say they, they always look at us as this still the little child that they carry around that day and especially if you've been doing this like your whole life like like I said my family's from the island so even at my age you know like I, I, I just like I tell everybody that know my family my mom's she's her family's from the islands as well, but she was born here. You know what I'm saying? She's hood. She's from the projects. But he and my dad's side of the family, they just still look at us as this child. I mean, I had to explain to my mother that because she was so used to me being a certain way and being with a certain person. She couldn't, it's like, in my family, we stay married, you know what I'm saying? We stay with the person forever, for life. She couldn't understand that <clears throat> it didn't work, you know what I'm saying? Or it's it's done with. Then when I found somebody else, it took her a long time to accept that I was happy, you know? This person made me happy, and this person was the some, what I was looking for all along. You know, so when she finally realized that I was right all the time about, and she was just like, that person makes you happy. She asked me, I was like, yeah. And she was just like, well, I'm all for it. I just want to see my son happy. I like to see you happy, smiling in your old self. And sometimes it's like that. And sometimes she still she still calls me this 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 nickname. You know what I'm saying? I'm like I'm, I'm like mom. I'm a grown man now. I got kids. 
you know what I'm saying? I understand. Then she couldn't understand, like, she always thought that like, she was going to be the number one woman in my life. I'm like, yeah, you will, you always would be my mom's, but I want to find, I need happiness too, you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? This person is in my life, you know what I'm saying? She, she does things for me, you know what I'm saying? And... And everything, and we're supposed to be building something here, you know. So you have to, you have to find a way that you can accept it. You know what I'm saying? And I'm sure that she would say the same thing to you. You gotta accept. I'm not saying she'll say it disrespectfully, but say, yeah, um, his woman and stuff like this. We're building something here, and that's how, that's how it is. Is is. It's all about respect. And it's like, like I said, if people, or I say, just have control. You know what I'm saying? Like, I always peep stuff. You know what I'm saying? When someone's trying to bully me in some type of way and stuff, at first I won't say nothing. Then as the time goes on and I get upset, not upset, but a little something, I'll be like... <clears throat> Because a lot of people that try to have mind control with people, they really think that the person is very stupid. A lot of people think a lot of people are stupid as fuck. You, and it's crazy. The ones that think that you're not very smart or intelligent, they are the dumb ones. Like, always have, I always learned to have, have a certain type of value in yourself. When I mean a certain value, I mean, like... Know, like, what your worth is on this planet Earth. You know, like, if you have a good heart, show not, 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 uh, don't just say, yeah, I have a good heart. Like, show and prove to yourself that you, you, you have a good, a good heart. Show that, you know what I'm saying, that you're a good person, not just around certain people always show it I have all times like you know what I'm saying like I was told like I'm a healer and I know I am that's something that I'm gonna have to change some type of way but that's supreme this is supreme intelligence this is a video and um like share subscribe and peace